Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Anasha, aka Drippy Nails, and I'm back with another nail submission video. Your nail technicians send in their work to be reviewed, reacted to, and also I give constructive criticism. If you're interested in watching this video, definitely stay tuned. If you're interested in being featured here on my YouTube channel, click on the description box and look at the details and see how you can send your work and be featured here on my YouTube channel. So let's get straight into this YouTube video. All right, guys, our first nail submission comes from, ooh, Anonymous. She wants to be anonymous, so I have her info, but you guys aren't going to get that. But I will let her know in the video so she knows I'm talking about her. She is from the Chicago area. She is 23. Um, and the set that you guys are also going to be looking at, of course, she's going to know this is her work, but this is a anonymous submission. Um, she said that she did these nails for Halloween. And it is March Simpson as the Bride of Frankenstein. So let's look. I'm going to tap and download. Let's see what it looks like. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Is this a... No, this is a this is a hand. You can't fool me. This fake hand. This is a fake hand. I was about to say, girl, this client got some nice nail bends and some nice fingers. I think I have this hand. But anyways, back to the nails. Looks like you have a lot going on and i don't mean that in a negative way i'm like you are very artsy you know how to tie in colors throughout the nail it looks like a picture not like an actual set i like that um so let's just start with we'll start with each nail and i'll critique each one for you so with the pinky black and the little miler at the end i like it you have a nice apex great shape the March Simpson Frankenstein Bride. I'm not sure what you're using for your nail art. Um, as you guys know here on my YouTube channel, I personally like to use acrylic paint. I do not, I am not fond of gel. I do not like gel, um, gel polish. I don't, I don't use gel to paint personally. I feel like gel is easier than acrylic paint. I will say that though, but I personally do not use it. Um, I'm not sure if you used actual nail polish. It looks like you used nail polish. Nail polish is tedious to use when it comes to nail art because of course you're fighting time and drying. And you know nail polish gets really tacky as soon as it comes out the freaking bottle. So it is really hard to work with. Ooh, does Mark Simpson have minor hair? Girl. Okay, you did your shit on this. I like this. That's very creative. Very creative. Okay, so the next nail again, you have the same thing with the miler and the black. I really like this. Your shape is good. The miler on the pointer finger on the very far um on the very far right. I really like this miler. You placed it very nicely throughout the nail, giving full coverage. I really like this. So one thing I will oh you are using red iguana. I see the box in the back. Okay. So with the March Simpson, one thing I will recommend is like just work on lines. Just work on your line work. Work on your line work. Work on your full coverage. But overall like this is really good. If this is your first time doing this, you did a good job girl like painting is really hard i know i make it look easy i've been drawing and painting since i've been out the womb so i know you guys are like dang what the heck i was doing painting and i've been an artist musician before i got into nails so i just decided to collab music and art onto nails and that's how you got drippy nails but when it comes to your artwork and it comes to this particular design just work on your line work find a um Find if gel is for you, if polish is for you, or acrylic paint. Find out which works best for you. But like I said, this looks like polish. And if this is polish, you did a good job. If this is gel, just work on tweaking it a little bit, having cleaner lines. Also look into some nail brushes. Nail brushes will definitely be a huge investment for you when it comes to your nail art. Um, not all brushes are the same and two also, you know in the nail industry you get what you pay for if you are cheap You are going to get cheap stuff. I don't care what anybody says now There are some exceptions sometimes you can find some cheap stuff and it is good But nine times out of ten it's it's boo-boo So just invest in like some good nail brushes, but other than that you did a really good job on this I really like this um, this artwork that you did for Halloween. Thank you again for sharing and I will definitely send this link to you directly once I am done editing and uploading this video. 